What is up, monsters? Real Monsters here, and welcome back to another video. Today, we're hopping back into Asterios, Curse of the Stars. Lord Marple, uh. I heard that the situation in the bazaar is deteriorating. Can we retake the amphitheater? My lady, even if we could take the amphitheater back now, it's not defensible, nor is it of any strategic importance. Just be patient. Our counteroffensive will succeed. Are your soldiers really up to the task? Yes! This is all making us doubt you! Rest assured, everything is under control. You're free to offer your opinions, but please remember who allows you your liberties. Archon, the outsider is coming. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> Everyone? This is Hilda of the North Wind Legion. She's the outsider that defeated Eulalia. Let's welcome her. She's a hero and deserves our praise. Uh, thank you. But I'm no hero. Many would agree. As an outsider, <laughs> you not only broke into the city without permission, but also created even more chaos by killing Barad. And let's not forget that your kingdom's legion is working for Eumenides. You've caused great unrest among the citizenry, and created new threats. Well... Akon, she killed Eulalia. That doesn't make up for her mistake, does it? Tell me, why should I tolerate outsiders causing chaos in my city? I explained it quite clearly in the letter, Akon. Thank God Mistress, that I was going to have to talk. You really came. Yes. And I assume you're going to be busy preparing for the trial? Yes, of course. Battle Maiden, I will keep my promise. You did explain in the letter, though I am having trouble believing that the adherents rely so heavily on this young girl. I can hear your disappointment. But in Aphis, a young girl can possess a millennium of experience. Actions always outweigh appearances. I believe you would agree. Sister, how are you? I'm fine. Thank you for your concern. I'm ready to begin the trials at any time. Wait, sister. Hold on just one minute. Before you take the trials, can she... Can this little girl really protect you? I have no doubt about my choice. You also had no doubt about your husband. Don't worry, Arthur. Hmm. We trust Minerva's judgment. Okay, <laughs> going on. And how did that girl know so much about me? I don't think I've ever met that girl in my life. Right. I think I've spent enough time at the party. Yeah, I don't know what I'm supposed to do at the party, so Sorry, I I, I talked to a whole bunch of people. So uh, I almost fell asleep. <clears throat> By the way, your house is lovely. It must have been full of life before the curse. Strictly speaking, this is my father's house. Humanities and I lived elsewhere. Are you all right? I'm fine. I drank a few glasses of Stardust wine and spent some time speaking with other Aristoi. How are things? Marble's reputation has reached rock bottom. I have a good chance of persuading other Aristoi to support me. But they're also waiting to see how I perform. They all see themselves as being above a criminal like me. You're different from them. Only when you dare to act can you make a difference. Even if you're burdened with sin? Hmm. Let's get down to business. I've kept my promise, and Marbles formally agreed to hold the trials of remission. The location is Prima Boulevard. We have to pass four consecutive rounds of fights arranged by the Legion. Are you sure you're up to it? I have faith Piece in my Piece of cake. Magic. Not to mention you'll be there. And from now until the trials begin, the Legion must protect me in the name of the three. They're rigid and bound by convention. You won't have to worry about being ambushed. Should we head out? No, we'd better split up. I need you to do one thing before the trials. What do you want to ask? Think. 
fucking god. Alright, let's help that. Hilda, great. You came just in time. Hey, what are you doing here? I discovered that the cultist's assembly area is right behind that door. And the security here is lax. But the door's locked. We have to find the key. Got it. I searched the sewer and found these documents. I think they're relevant to the collusion between the cultists and the Aristoi. Frostwing? They knew so much about the Aristoi. I didn't expect we'd been infiltrated so thoroughly. So these documents can be used as evidence that someone has polluted with the cultists. I'm not so sure. If we hand them over now, they'd be able to destroy any other evidence. Plus, they don't directly say that anyone's infiltrated the sewer. I'm afraid these won't convince people. What are you planning to do? If we can get into their assembly area, I'm sure we can get better evidence. You're a good fighter, so you should go and search around. I've noticed some boxes that the cultists are particularly protective of. Maybe we can find the key there. Is it this one? Matches the keyhole, so it must be. Narcus, why are you insisting on getting into their assembly area right now? Are you doubting me? Um, no. Oh, it feels so awful to be doubted by the heroine I admire so much. Ask me anything. I'll answer as best I can. Oh, all right. If you have I'm any questions, feel now. free to ask. Hello. dignity that you of all people would turn to the Ephraim. We're getting what we need from each other. Can you guarantee that Minerva will give us a better life? Or are you stupid enough to believe that woman? Even so, to take refuge with a cult. The Ephraim will no longer be a cult anymore if we legitimize it. If you tried even once to look at the Ethras with an open mind, you'd know that your accusations are based on blind prejudice. Then tell me why you and Aristotle haven't been sublimated while the others who joined the cult have turned to monsters. Admit it, you're just a brutal, self-serving cult. I have important missions I must carry out before undergoing sublimation. You're cute, but so naive. Maybe I should keep you around as a pet werewolf. <laughs> Don't you want to be with me? Narcus of House Narda. I... I... I refuse! Agnes, why have you gathered the cultists here? Don't worry. I'll reveal the secret to you as you die! Too slow. Narcus! Let's go, Lawrence. You first. I'll stay behind and make sure they're truly done for. Fine. I'll leave it to you. You! Now. Hello. Oh, that's cute. 
Dude, is there more? Oh, there is more. Oh, hey, what's up, guys? Oh, hey, guys. Fortunately, I have a defensive star right. Oh, that's great. So you're all right? I just need some rest. Look around and see if there's any evidence we can use. You got it, boss. deployment for Argus Plaza. Mm. If the Etheris have this intelligence, it's only a matter of time before they breach the plaza. Yeah, that would suck. Although, I'm just an outsider. They make it very well, very well known that I'm just an outsider. Sorry I kept you waiting. Is everything all right? We have mm. evidence that Agnes not only is a cultist, but that she's also infiltrated the Legion and is planning to take Argus Plaza. Agnes? I never thought my suspicions would be confirmed. Do you already know? A while back, Argus reported to me that he thought someone was planning to invade Laurel Mansion from the sewer. Although the sewer is overseen by marble soldiers, there are some strange holes in their defenses. I had no evidence, nor could I say what's in that sewer. Your instincts were right. I'm sure with this evidence, Marvel will have to listen to reason. Let's take the trials first. I'll find the right moment to use it. Ready? Man, I don't care about the details of no damn trial. Ready to just Ready. go. Let's fuck some shit up. During the fight, don't worry about me. Just keep moving forward. Priest, everything is ready. Okay. I don't have to worry about it either, then I will just continue going Minerva, forward. Minerva, the center of House Ballroom is about to undergo the trials of a mission with the approval of Marvel, the Archon of Legion. Minerva and her warrior will sincerely pray to the three to redeem themselves in blood. I, Wassily, a devoted Minerva and representative of the Aristoi, will bear witness to everything. Let the trials begin! Just so you know, I will leave you behind. Alright, I guess I'm going this way. Okay, so first things first. Let's get some more. Just a little bit. Get you out of here real fast. Stay back. I got you. 
地。This is... Do something about it. Your reputation is in ruins. No one will believe you are capable of anything ever again. Or maybe, do you want to do it yourself? We've officially passed the trials, right? Yes. It's amazing, mistress. Congratulations on your completion of the trials. Under the witness of the representative of the Aristoi, and the Archon of Legion, and the Gods of Stars, I will officially repeal. Wait. Yeah, come on, buddy boy. I want to fight you. Is there a Been problem, a Lord Marble? Mistress Minerva, you have redeemed yourself. That is quite clear. And you regain your noble status. But your warrior has not. She has committed numerous crimes. I will deal with her here and now. What? That can't be right. She completed the trials with me. She did. But only because she was designated by you as your only guard. I hadn't interfered because you hadn't completed your trials yet. Outsiders are not citizens. And the law doesn't apply to them. That's fine. You don't understand. This child is crucial to saving Aphis. I went along with your pointless trials. Why is everybody now keep calling me a child? With How the same old is my character laws? supposed to be? Do you want me to make you an exile again, Mistress Minerva? By the gods, you disgust me. You've left That's me no right. choice, Marble. Before the trial, I uncovered evidence that Aphis has turned yeah. to also colluded with Centurion Lawrence, and they conspire to launch an attack on Argus Plaza. Look at the evidence. Centurion Lawrence has given the him? all of your military deployments. What? Well, um, today is just the truth. 
trials of remission. We'll need to convene a religious court at another time for identification and judgment. Listen to me. The cult is going to ravage Argus Plaza. Can I fight him? The threat from Eumenides is imminent. We are running out of time. I risked my life today in front of the gods of stars. Not for myself, but for all of Aphis. Yeah, you tell him, Minerva. Agnes and Lawrence. No. Oh. Marble, let go of your pride. We can still work together to fight the cult and Eumenides. Now's not the time to... Silence! You lie. You're attempting to deceive everyone. You think you can distinguish right from wrong better than the three? You dare speak of justice? Yes! Enough! I'm here to personally yes. see to his punishment.
take your lumps. Oh, I killed him. Did I kill him? Kill him? By the gods! Outsider, what have you done? He came at me! You all saw it! He was doing his duty, nothing more. You, however, murdering an Archon is a heinous crime. If you want to convict Hilda, remember that I am involved as well. I helped her. Mistress, I... don't worry. I am on your side. In fact, I believe now is the time. Please, take it. This is... the Archon Relic. On behalf of the Error Story, and witnessed by the Gods of Stars, I will tolerate the actions of this outsider until the Trinity Night comes. Outsider, your behavior will determine what happens next. I said I didn't. Hilda, it's all right. We have the relic. Though I do know the way he looks down on non ephesians is pathetic. Watch yourself, Minerva. I can modify the results of the trials at any time. <laughs> you wouldn't dare. As Trinity Knight approaches, so does the key to lifting our curse. I, Minerva of House Laurel, hereby promise that there will be a way to end this. No matter what Eumenides is planning on that mountain, Hilda and I will stop him. And I will prove that these prejudices against outsiders are wrong. Very well. I'm sure the Gods of Stars have heard your promise. I look forward to whatever you're going to do, Mistress. In the name of the One, I will succeed. Hilda, let me know if you're ready to go back to the shelter. Well... Mm, yeah, that was, uh... That kind of put me between a rock and a hard place there. I didn't think that I actually killed him, though. And in my defense, he was not seeing reason. Alright, Minerva, what do you have to say for yourself? For your crimes upon outsiders. Look at this wall of ice. You just let that stand. We were raised in the old ways. To achieve Aphis's glory and spiritual values. But long before we became the adherents, we should have realized that no matter how perfect a system is, it will grow corrupt over time. Marble, the Archon who devoted everything to his country, eventually became nothing more than a puppet of the system. And here we are, just wishing to get our hands on a sliver of the glory of days past. Minerva? I'm fine. I need you to get back safely. Soldiers have already appeared on Prima Boulevard. We better leave before the situation gets more chaotic. But, Marble... I feel bad for him. He didn't deserve that. You saw. Those Aristoi put him under enormous pressure. And it's my turn to shoulder it. No. We'll end this together. Thank you. Sorry to interrupt, Mistress. Narcus and I have found Agnes. And? What were you able to find out? She turned into a beast to attack us. We were forced to eliminate her. Narcus is collecting more information, which I believe will help the adherents. Thank you, Bion. That's good to know. Hilda, I need to keep in touch with the Aristoi. Why don't you rest up? And thank you. Her performance was... extraordinary. Everything's ready, Hilda. Tell me when you're good to go. Ooh, whoa! Okay, so this is like... End, end game. Holy shit, oh man, I ain't ready for this right now. There's so many things that I gotta do. I gotta talk to Bion. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta talk to... The, I gotta talk to the other girl. Let's see if there's anything going on there. 
I need to, oh my god, there's so many things. So many things. 